Hey guys, this is Shumon from ASA Technical. Today I am going to show you how to fix Windows encountered a problem installing the drivers for your device and Windows has stopped this device because it has reported problems. Maybe sometimes you are facing such a problem on your Windows computers and laptops, such as Windows encountered a problem installing the drivers for your device. Windows has stopped this device because it has reported problems code 43. The error code 43 is basically generated when device manager stops a hardware device because the hardware reported to Windows that it's having some kind of unspecified problem. Although most errors code 43 appear on graphics card and external USB device, such as happened in my case with the Intel's video card. Also the error code 43 can be appearing on any hardware device in device manager and any Microsoft's operating system may encounter with this error Error code 43 in device manager, including Windows 10, Windows 8.1, Windows 7, Windows Vista, Windows XP, etc., such as happened in my Windows 10 PC. Whatever the issue, don't worry about it. By following these instructions in this video, you can easily get the solution of this error code 43. Well, let's get started. At first, let me show you what happened in my case. As you can see that this PC has the Microsoft generic display driver is installed and when I am going to update device driver software here shows that downloading the necessary device driver software but during installing driver software here shows that Windows encountered a problem installing the drivers for your device and Windows has stopped the device because it has reported problems in port 43. As you can see, my PC has Intel HD 620 graphics hardware component. Alright, to fix the problem, you need to download display driver software from manufacturer website according to your PC's video card, I mean graphics card hardware. If your PC has Intel's graphics hardware component, then just follow me to downloading the necessary device driver software from manufacturer website. At first, open the browser and type in the address or URL bar www.intel.com. Next click on support, then click on download and drivers, then click on browse for drivers, then click on graphics driver, then select your certain product from here as you can see. Then select download type drivers. Next select operating system according to your PC system which you are using. Then just click on Intel graphics driver for Windows 10 or which you are using. As you can see this is the latest version. Alright from here you can download executable file I mean .exe file or .zip file which you prefer. Next, I'm just extract this .zip file. Next, open the folder which you got after extracting. Next, just double click on setup file to install. Here, as you can see, here another problem has arisen. The driver being installed is not validated for this computer. I think it's really very unnecessary disturbance in Windows computer. Anyway, now let's fix the problem. Now just click on No. Next just double click on graphics folder to open it. Next just copy the full path of this file or folder as you can see. Next go to control panel. Next click on device manager. 
Next, right click on your PC's default display driver. Then click on update driver. Next, choose the option browse my computer for driver software. Then select the option let me pick from a list of device drivers on my computer. Alright, then click on have disk. Next paste here the full path of those file or folder which was copied as you can see. Next click on OK. Next select the manufacturer and model of your hardware device. Then click on next. Now as you can see status shows that installing device driver software. Be patient for a while. Do nothing. After completing the process, display screen resolution changes by itself automatically, as you can see. Alright, as you can see, status shows that Windows has successfully updated your drivers. Then click on Close. Then click on Scan for hardware changes. Now close all other tabs. Next open the display driver folder. Next double click on setup file to install. Yeah done. As you can see now it's ready to be installed. Now click next. Next click on yes and then next. Now be patient for a while do nothing. Now click on next. Now just click on finish. Now let me show you the graphics driver version. As you can see, this is the Intel's latest graphics driver version of 2018. Now just restart once, that's it. We hope you will like. Of course, let us know your opinion. If you have any question, then please let us know. Please like, comment, share. We need your support and guys please don't forget to subscribe our channel. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.